Welcome back to our Valentine's Day edition, Cocktails with Heather and AD and Terrell and Lexi. We are gonna have a couple's Valentine's Day wine tasting edition today. And we're gonna do a little couple's therapy throughout this wine tasting. We're gonna have some questions asked that might put you in the hot seat or the good seat this Valentine's Day. <laughs> My homie got his curls out, so it's good. Yeah, he got <laughs> Bro, I can't do nothing, no. All right, come on, man, let's do it. Okay. That's the proper one. Yeah. So you grab it. Okay. Wait, stir it around. What are we tasting? Yeah. No, no, you grab it by this, the, the bottom. Wow. The stem. Okay. The stem. Yeah. T row, T row. Hands down, hands down. <laughs> Touch the stem. Touch the stem. Okay. So what are we drinking I'll, today? I'll explain as, as you guys start drinking. Then you smell it. Okay, now smell it. You guys are first drinking the Cosquil Argentinian Pinot Noir. It's a red wine. It has a medium body to it. And what kind of, You don't like it? She don't drink I actually I love this it's one. Good. I love what it do you guys too. taste? This? You don't want to know what I, I taste. taste. Sour grapes. <laughs> it's really. <laughs> well, that shit is disgusting. I love it. Let it's sweet, but it also has like that really strong red wine taste. It's, Ooh. it's oaky. This, yeah, that's like, a good. That's a good description. This tastes like I took a piece of bark and I put it in my mouth. Yeah, and that's exactly what it tastes like with a little sweetness. So y'all eat bark. See, that's what white people do. Yeah. Right? yeah. The notes of this is vanilla, floral, and cherry. Mm -hmm. They're long. I'll taste okay. it. Can I finish it? It should be, yes. It should be a smooth, silky texture and a delicious fruit profile with notes of blue flower as well. Ooh, I See, feel that it. sounds so good, but I wish it really tasted you like that. You have to have, you know, you gotta, you gotta have that acquired taste. Can well, we shot drink. it? I don't drink. Yeah, yeah, I'm ready to drink mine up, but I want to eat the food with it. Yes. Okay. okay. So let me Can try the let bottle. Let me take a sip refill. and then let me try to eat the this food is and see. This is prosciutto see. with prosciutto with soft cheese, which is brie and some crackers. This is what it's best paired with. Yes. Okay. That's what they say. This well, don't look like no cheese. This look so... like vanilla. Okay. Make sure you don't eat. The <laughs> yeah. Wax. Don't eat the wax. Don't eat the wax. Just the inside. Oh no! I love shark. Me, this I, is me, my favorite. I this is good. A little, a little jam with it. Mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. honey or honey, yeah. Okay, mm -hmm. hold on. So you are supposed to do it up with shark this? Shark is ten out of ten. You know what I mean? And then. Mm-hmm. That's a good one. That's really good. Yeah. Oh, we need a refill. Yo, yeah. you guys wouldn't need a refill. Even we wine tasting. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I don't know. Oh wait, I'm holding it wrong. We're gonna get hers. drunk over here in cocktails, Heather and Avi. We do every week. Alrighty, so taste your wine one more time and then we're going to rate it. The ratings, one through 10. I'm gonna give this wine an eight. I'm gonna give it a nine. I'm gonna give this wine a zero. I made my own zero and I circled it. The more I taste it, the more sweeter it is. I like the oak taste, you know what I'm saying? I can tell it's been in the barrel for a little while, you know what I mean? Yeah. I think it's smooth, it's sweet. It's a little dry, which I like. It leaves Me my too. mouth Me a too. little dry which makes it good to go in for a grape or some cheese or whatever the case. I like it though. I could just see myself. I'm on my grown woman. I the said dryness that. is called the body of the wine. Oh, well, I love the body. So it has a wine. light body because it makes it dry. Okay, so I'm gonna give it a seven. It was, it was, it was leaning towards Lexi. You know what I'm saying? Uh, zero, <laughs> but then I ate that cheese and the cracker in there. And then I started sipping on it a little bit and it started complimenting it. So the cheese and the cracker really got that going. So I'm like, I can still keep doing it. So I'm gonna go ahead and get at a seven, even though I'm new at this. Okay. I'm new at this, so I'm gonna go ahead and give us a seven because I think this is what you're supposed to be doing. That's why we got the grapes and the oranges on the table, right? Mm -hmm. All right, all right, yeah, yeah. So we're gonna be and doing your curls. that. And your curls. I said, see, <laughs> I'm gonna lead. I, I, somebody say one more thing about my curls, I'm gone. Okay. I told you you look good today. What are you talking you about? Great you did, you did, you did tell me I look good today. <laughs> Cause she could be bullshit trying to be like, bro, it's all good. Like, trying to pump you up? Trying to butter you up before I tell. Nigga got curls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 
Mama, this nigga got curls. They came in here. <laughs> he went and got his haircut this morning and came back with curls. He's like, we're going to get a haircut and came back with curls. So I don't know. Wait. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's wait the one. Let's wait this and start Let rating Lexi my curls. Let her white. Let Lexi I did. Zero. 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 Oh, shit. <laughs> Come on. She I made got a zero on her and she I circled smooth, it. Dry. I think I'm just not an alcohol person. Like, I love mocktails. That's fine, my love. I love mocktails. That is perfect. You're great high. in other areas. Thanks. But here on cocktails, we're we going to get Lexi a little tipsy. We got some non-alcoholic wine just for you, Lexi, that we're okay. going to try today. But I mean, do I gotta try take it? A yeah, she's trying it for you. How is it a non? What do you mean? You don't gotta I drink everything. Try it oh, okay. It's Let's probably it. like a non-alcoholic beer. How it kind of tastes like beer. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Be Well Dealcoholized White Chardonnay Wine. So ain't no alcohol, right? There's no alcohol. You smell it. I'm gonna treat the same way. So let's give it a swirl and taste it. I love this glass. Thank you. It smells like an olive. It smells like alcohol. No, it don't. Interesting. It, it smells like an olive. So with this wine, you should enjoy the flavors of golden delicious apple, hints of oak and vanilla, along with a touch of honey. There's no alcohol. <laughs> I know. It doesn't taste like apple juice. It tastes like well, I got my flavored score. water. Negative five. Yeah, that's horrible. This is terrible. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> I made my own score. Six at zero on that one. Yeah. It's like pee water. <laughs> it's not good. This is terrible. No. This is another zero on the board. Okay, so I'm eating my sushi. And now sushi. we're supposed to eat sushi. Yeah. This first word was sushi. It was with, yeah. Says who? Mmm. <laughs> Let's see this nasty ass piss water. <laughs> It's definitely pee water. Mm, oh, fucking God. That shit is whack. Mm. And this, this glass is too beautiful for this junk. Agreed. It tastes like, like, this tastes like an olive. Oh, fucking olive. Don't remind me. But an olive. Olives tastes better. It tastes than this. like a rotten olive. Like, that's been out for ew, like six ew, years. I keep smelling it and it's grossing me out. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> this is one of the worst drinks I had in my life. Agreed. Safe to say we all hate this one. Safe this is say. not it. If you don't drink, just Negative drink fire. soda because this ain't it. Are we rating this? Might as well just. Would you down. rather drink that or a real alcohol? Real alcohol. Real alcohol. The fuck? This doesn't. This. It's like pee water. <laughs> Number one is and she flat. She got a gang of that shit in her cup. Number one is flat. This shit sucks. Number one is flat. What's going on? Oh this my god, it. we gotta rate it. We gotta rate it. We all did. rated a big fat fucking zero. I put a negative zero five. Zeros across the board. I don't even want to taste it. I really, I really want to like one. Like I, rate, I, I rated this shit. Don't worry about nothing. Yeah. All right, Lexi, what's the most romantic thing AD has ever done for you? Mm. Oh my gosh, there's so many. Okay, so AD is Aww. very romantic. I was not, I was actually very surprised at how romantic he was. Cause you know, it's like, you wouldn't expect that from a guy like AD, but he's very good at Valentine's Day. So Valentine's Day, he rented out an entire hookah lounge for me. Cause I really like hookah. So he rented out a hookah lounge for me. Trash. No. <laughs> he rented out a hookah lounge for me and was like DJing the night. It was really cute and romantic. And of course he took me to dinner and of course he got me flowers and jewelry and all the girly stuff. <laughs> and T-Row's a hater because he's, T-Row's what, 15 years in, so now he feels like he don't gotta do nothing. Oh, yes. Damn. Hey, hold on, bro. Damn. Damn. That's the game. You know, one year damn. relationship. Damn. You know what I'm saying? We're going on Come three. Come here, yeah, go in here. We're just going on a relationship, man. That's All cool, right. that's cute. So what type of guy is AD? He is, he's hard on the outside and soft on the inside. Oh, okay. so he so only he, did that for you and your relationship. He didn't do that in his prior relationship. Bro, why are you worried about prior relationships? That's true. What the hell is wrong with you? I'm just saying, you know, you just start doing that. Men men want to do things for people that they feel <laughs> like deserve it. It's true. And oh. that's just what it is. Every every woman brings out a different side of a man. One hundred percent, for sure. And that's no shade to anybody prior to me. That's no shade. It's I like just, to think I bring out the best in everyone. Y'all sound like Rick Ross' girlfriend. You got the granny star. That's what I My don't sound like. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, since it's been so long, Terrell, <laughs> what <laughs> if you could relive any moment with Heather? What would it be? Getting his curls down today. <laughs> <laughs> that's a cute question. 
If it, I can relive any moment with Heather, what would it be? Don't cry. Um, I'm going to cry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to cry. It would probably be us driving 26 hours from Texas to LA. Trash. <laughs> oh, please. I would have been complaining the whole That's night. That's a great one, Terrell, because we had a motherfucking time. I already lived that moment again. We did. <laughs> I knew. I was like, dang, I'm driving with this girl. I ain't got being no a, choice. Her, uh, definitely a passenger princess. I ain't got no choice but to take care of this girl. Who was being a passenger princess? Terrell, I drove all. I <gasps> drove us here. I drove 26 hours straight, bitch. We didn't stop at all. I respect that, Heather. No, but first I of all, it up. was her car. I come up. It was her car. Her her daddy, you know, I'm seeing her off. So I, I didn't want to get out the car. I'm like, hey, The car that you gave me the down payment on. Yeah, but see, it's still, though. It's your car, though. So you know how parents is. Like, it's your, your car, your insurance. So you was already driving. I'm like, fuck it. We just keep going. <laughs> he didn't ask. He never he went back. Huh? He didn't he didn't ask, ask. Hey, nah, never went back. He didn't ask, like, back. hey, do you want to switch off? You like, girl, you I drove the last two That's hours. Sad. Talking about you. When we were in California, so she drove a when whole day. When we got to California, you a piece of shit. I was oh, the one on one. I know her, man. Like what? <laughs> she acting like she was asleep. She over there passing out. You good, girl? No, no. hell no. We was up. We was going crazy. My dad. That's what I do. My dad is a really good driver, and he taught me to be a really good driver. We've always had road trips and I just know how to drive. I'd rather drive myself. I drove myself to labor. I'd rather drive T-Rail. myself than have somebody in jeopardy of my life. She, I don't have time Driving to labor sounds crazy. I drove to labor twice. <gasps> what the fuck is wrong with you? You drove to labor twice? I'm what? Sure. Drove to labor Could to go get induced. Okay, so that's what she means. Go get induced so the baby wasn't actually And coming. where were you? She had to go make the baby oh, come. So you well, gotta really explain that I drove myself to my labor <laughs> sounds wow in the title. Twice. Yeah, exactly. Hey, I put, hey, put that on there. I should, I should have put that in the title. That's for sure, for sure. But driving yourself, you gotta go get induced, induced. They gotta, you know what I'm saying, give you the year and I mean, and then make you start, uh, what is it? Uh, dilating. Dilating. They gotta start. Or they can bust that water bag for you. Well, well you have they to dilate. Bust, yeah. So as soon as they induce you, they gotta, they, they gonna break your water. So you ain't got no choice after that. You done for the night. But yeah, man, that's what I would do. I would relive that moment because that was a great moment for us. Yeah, because you know how to drive. <laughs> Damn, why you hating? You took your girl to a hookah bar. She over here happy. The whole thing. She wanted to go to Hot BBs. I can she, take her over there. She had it to herself. It she had to go to Hot BBs. There wasn't had nobody in there. She had it to herself. She, and okay. The BBs. In the middle of the dance floor. Man, get the hell up out Boring. Of here. Boring. 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 <laughs> <laughs> We're not couples against couples, y'all. Stop. Yes, we are. We beefing. Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs>
That cheese was jumping off the table. <laughs> this is some of my favorite cheese. Because I have a question. What is something that Lexi says to turn you on? Oh, it's getting spicy up in here. I'm not like Take that. that sweater off, baby. Let me see that belly. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see that belly, baby. She'll say something like, how about some buns? But I'm like, yes. I want some buns. How about some buns? That's what he called. How about you getting these buns? He's like, I want buns. I'm like, okay, how about some buns? Okay. But I'm not, I'm not a hypersexual person, so I'm not very like, I don't know how to explain it. I'm not either though. No. So I'm not like sexy talk. I'm more like baby talk, like stupid stuff. Yeah, it's stupid. That's me. Well, I'm neither. <laughs> <laughs> I don't got time for all that. Daddy, uh-uh. Daddy is definitely not coming baby, out my mouth. Daddy, like, boo is like my max. <laughs> boo sounds terrible. Boo is trash. Does, does it bother you that I don't call you baby or babe? I don't like that type of shit. Yeah, what you like? What you, what you like her to call you? Let me fuck up. <laughs> That's what he knew how to do. <laughs> He's like, give me some of these cheeks. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, All right. Give me some of these cheeks. I'm oh, dead. Shit. Okay, so this wine is best paired with the hard cheese and salami. This is my favorite. I love salami. I grew up on salami. This salami and crackers. Fresh. Why you give me two? Can you put a stupid one? Oh. Mm. You put the cheese inside yours? Oh, mm -hmm. I put it with a cracker like this. Mm. I ain't had no cracker on. Hey, he's hungry. This is my favorite. Mm -hmm. mm. We gotta put it all together. Mm -hmm. That's some chef shit. My you can't just eat boy, one lady. ingredient by itself, bro. You gotta do all three. You ever thought about like who just made this up? Ooh, that motherfucker's <laughs> a 10 it's now. Type of, is it like Persian or? No, I think it's more like it's more like European taste now, vibes. For real. Just taste I, now, I feel real. like millennials made it up because we grew up on Lunchables. But I feel like th this is like per have you ever <laughs> no, had like a know. Persian or like a French breakfast? This is like what they eat with an egg, mm -hmm. literally a hard boiled egg and a coochie yeah, board. Yeah, when we were in Turkey, a coochie board. <laughs> when they was in, when I was in Turkey, I ate about a hundred different cheeses, mm -hmm. breads, pastries. I'm talking about that's all they ate. Oh, yeah. yeah. No meat, Paul. Oh, the flavor mm. of this is not bad. Nope. It's the dryness of the mouth that kind of throws sweat. me off. But the flavor is not bad. So I'm going to give this wine a three. Okay, Heather, what is one new experience you want to share with Terrell this year? A threesome. Woo! <laughs> Let's fucking do it. We going crazy. <laughs> but well. I don't know who to do it with. It had to be with a stranger. Like a stranger, we'd have to go out of town, we'd have to go on vacation, Mexico, something, Colombia, I don't know where the bad bitches are at. I have a question. And then do it up. Woo! What's the question? Are you sure you want to open those floodgates? Don't wait, hold on. You're not about to hate on this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Next question, yeah, please. Yeah, yeah. Don't shut that hey. down right now. Tell her, hey, 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 hey. We're not doing that. Hey, hey, hey. No, no, that's their, that's their couple's therapy, so she needs to butt out. <laughs> yeah. I'm not hating on it. Ah. Yeah. I'm not. So would you do it? You know what? Uh -huh. I used to think, oh, in this time, I don't want to open no. that up because I've seen all my friends do it. Their niggas still cheat on them. It's just, but I just want to experience it one time in my life because I haven't. I'm not into girls or like, you know, but it's just, I want to do that for him. I've been with him for 14 years, faithfully. I, well, I can say that I've been faithful. Can yeah, you? me too. Yeah. Yeah. Of so course. why not do it? But it would have to be with somebody that we don't know that we'll never see again walking in these LA streets. So it's rules. I see that. I I, I could see that. So y'all have never had a threesome? Mm -hmm. No. Yeah. I have. Like, I have at this point in, in our relationship. We're what in our relationship? We ain't there yet. Okay. What y'all doing? Y'all doing baby hookah bars. Haters you know say you hate. wouldn't do it? Come on. Haters so you would hate. never do it? I never said never. I'm just saying right now. I'm not there yet. I just don't feel like- You think I'm a lever? No, that's not what I think. I just feel like once you open that floodgate, it's like no going back. And I, I don't, I don't and want to, baby. It ain't happening again after that one time. But see, that's the thing. Baby, I don't I, want to, so don't worry about okay, it. Okay, babe, thank you. Yeah. But <laughs> I've heard of people who have done this and who have like opened up and done it and they regret it every time. I don't want to, so. But everybody's different, you never know. I have seen I'm everybody fine. regret it, they lie. I'm fine, I'm no, fine. Not the men. Of course not the men. <laughs> she lied. 
Of oh, course not know, the man. You lie. You, you lie. You gotta know your man. Right. Exactly. You gotta know your man. I know mine. He's not gonna get crazy. He's not. Gonna okay. Get crazy. One question then. So if I'm, I'm just going crazy, we got to <laughs> <some> going. <laughs> and then you're hitting the bitch up after. No, 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 no. I'm not just fucking. No, up. you're going crazy. No, I'm not hitting the bitch up afterwards. You feel me? Yeah. So you see me, <laughs> and I'm going. <laughs> That's and it's what going you're crazy. To do, I guess. You so, get yeah, it. Yeah, right? So that's cool. Beat the fuck out. Bitch, yeah, you know, beat the fuck out. I mean, that's what you're supposed to do. What else are you going to do? So you you're gonna pussy, that's out. So no. you saw, so, yeah, pack oh, her up. Yeah. There's part of it. No, you can <laughs> this bitch from the back and she's getting me out, and that's just it. Get the fuck out now. Woo! <laughs> Congratulations! <laughs> Might be the Let's go to Columbia, baby. <laughs> One thing the other going to do is turn it up. I'm going to do that. Yeah. Yeah. The other going to do is turn it up. Right, no, right, you right. going to turn it up. Okay, so okay, okay. Next, next, next. No, well, you guys have to rate your wine. Okay, rate my wine. I, I rated it a six. It's a little dry. I gave my wine a six, too. I gave mine a three. I'm the taste it. is there. The the dryness of the mouth is, is weird. I'm giving this an eight. <sighs> yeah, I didn't hate it. I didn't hate it, but I love the salami with the cheese, with the cracker. A1, whoever put this together is masterful. Whatever chef thought about that. All righty, our fourth course is a suckling Mercia Spaniard red blend. How do you do that? (laughs) Wow, look at it. Get a close up of that. That shit goes crazy. Okay, it is um, a full body wine and you should taste fruity and oak. I'm giving that one in. Definitely a nine. No. This is getting, ooh, this might be. I might get a 10 after I eat the short Cause we have, though. okay, cause we have two, one more left. So we gotta give this something a 10. It pairs best with beef and pork. Okay, let's see. Let me eat the, let me eat the uh, short rib first. Then I know it's gonna taste a little better. Love me some short ribs. Eat this shit up. Mm-hmm. Well, it was. They must have cold as hell. <laughs> Start with this fire. Mm-hmm. Let's see what we're working with. It's just sweet short rib. Mm-hmm. Mm. I taste vanilla. I want to say kind of like a blackberry. Let me see some vanilla. You can mm-hmm. also sm- you can also smell it. You're supposed to smell it with your mouth a little open to get the full. A little a little oaky. I have no clue. Yeah, I, I but don't. it's a nine. It's not as dry as, as the one before. No, which it's I not love. as dry. Your mouth isn't dry and it's sweet, which I love too. This is my favorite so far. Kind of tart. It's a Spaniard wine. It is tart. So what what's in there? Is it vanilla in there? It's fruity and oak. So you're right about, you said oak and well, you did say blueberry. The vanilla, I'm not understanding, babe. What do you mean by that? It's like a hint of vanilla. Okay. I was right. Yeah, I'm like, mm. Vanilla and oak. He just guessing at this point. He's saying any fucking thing. I was right. Cause you know all these wines got a little vanilla in it. No, they, they don't. Yes, they I've do. Never even no, heard they of don't. That. I don't know. Mm-mm. We need to run this steak well, back. This is my up. first I wine tasting, that. so I don't know shit. So I think AD's fucking great. He's like, oh Thank yeah, you. it's a little oak wood in there. It's a little vanilla. I literally, they taste all like. Nobody a cork. appreciates me. <laughs> do you know what I mean? They all taste like a cork to me. Like I'm sucking yeah, on a cork for sure. No, and because the oak though. They, That's they, the oak, yeah. They sit in the barrels mm-hmm. and they get flavor. Mm. Steak's fire. Yeah, the short rib is good. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna have a little grape to cleanse the palate. Me too. Me too. All right, we'll move on to our dessert course. Okay, before we start our dessert course, I have a, a therapy question for AD. Mm. What is one thing you think could make your relationship better? Oh, wow. I would say more understanding. That is on your end or Lexi's end? Both. Okay. Good man. Your understanding. I definitely would say that too. No, because we we come from two different walks of lives. Yes. And the way that she handles things, like she's, she's used to being alone, you know what I'm saying? And running the show all the time. And I have to tell her like, I'm a motherfucking man. Sometimes you need to sit back. Even like when we came here, she's like, you should pull in this way. You should go this route. No, I'm gonna go the routes I wanna fucking go. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, it's just understanding and 
learning each other more. I feel like I know her. I feel like she knows me and certain triggers that she knows not to press and certain triggers I don't like to press. So, yeah. All right, Terrell, what is one thing you think could make your relationship better? <sighs> Head every morning. Oh, my. Whoa! <laughs> Every single day, ah, be twice a real. day. Twice That's a day? Out. Be That's for real. crazy. We can start with every morning. Be for Maybe real. Maybe every right, morning, okay. every second. Yeah, I'm switching my answer too. <laughs> every morning. Yeah, you had a great answer. And then, and my shit was pussy compared to that. <laughs> and then, you can, you can do this. She can tell you where to go. Like, fuck it, I'll go. Where, where, where you want me to now, go? Now, if I got some head in the morning, I'll be like, you know what? I'm going to go this right <laughs> now. I'm going to go to the hell. You don't get head in the morning, but you get buns in the morning. So I don't know what we're talking about. AD's oh, yeah. sex Buns schedule and head is, is two different good. things. He has no complaints when it comes to his sexual schedule. Mm -hmm. He gets it every okay. single day. So what's the problem? Wow. Every single day? Yeah. Damn, so we they really knew. At we this, might okay? go one day, maybe two, maybe two. I'm going to give her a breather. Yeah, but damn, get off of her. <laughs> he won't. He won't. Let me be serious, but that is one, though. Head every morning is crazy. That, that's crazy. I agree with that. That's I agree that. with that. I fuck with that. But communication is still there. You got to have communication with your significant other. Because if you don't communicate with each other and y'all not on a, like a, you know, that same level playing, like things will get rocky as they go on. So I'm, I'm in a... 13, 14 year relationship, you feel me? Man, it's all communication. You gotta, you, you guys gotta be on that same level, communicate what's going on. What don't we uh, communicate? What don't we communicate? What don't we, we communicate? You have to speak with each other, you feel me? Your emotions have to be let out sometimes. sometimes and I let can, mine. Sometimes you can bottle up things. You. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I'll, I'll bottle up a lot of things sometimes. He's a man, though. I'll let things ride. You feel me? Like, cause I, I like a person to learn on their own. Uh, I like the person to go through experiences to kind of learn, and then I start getting agitated if I feel like you ain't learning. Cause some people take your kindness for weakness. You know what I mean? I feel that. I start getting agitated when you ain't learn. I'm like, come on, dog, you ain't learned. If you so give now, them the blueprint. Yeah, it's just like now you trying to, now you think, now you really think I'm a bitch. So now, Shit. so now I have to go ahead and explain. Now, I, once once it's all bottled up and you do it again and I snap, people don't be knowing why I snap because I didn't let the shit ride. Maybe I'm a Gemini. 10, 20 times. You're definitely we not. just men. Okay, yeah. let's taste this wine because I've already right, tasted yeah. it. I'm, I've already been sipping. All right, this is a white wine. It's from France Bordeaux. Okay. Mm. I, I like can definitely one. taste the, the grapes in this. Mm. It has a medium body. The medium body is perfect. And it has notes of citrus, lychee, and mineral. Citrus. I taste the lychee. I can taste the lychee too, really mm -hmm. strong. And the citrus. The grapes in the citrus. The acid the, from the citrus. This I would say is the best one. I'm no gonna give vanilla. It I'm gonna give it a taste. No, 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 no. We gotta eat it with the shit first, the pear. This is pears with, best with. I think Dessert. this is the best one because it's not strong. It's not making my mouth dry. Yeah. Like I, this White is, wine is, this is doable. Better. Like if I had to drink this something, pastry sucks. it would have to be this. <laughs> it's more of a dessert wine. Okay, so dessert. So you can't drink this. This dessert is trash. Okay, you should do complain a lot. I picked that pastry <laughs> out. <laughs> here, we have another pastry here. We have chocolate. We have those chocolate things. We have chocolate Yeah, cookies. give me a chocolate chip cookie. Nigga, it, taste that shit. It's a moose cake. Y'all like moose? This don't no, taste like dessert no moose. Give me a chocolate chip cookie. It's not strawberry. It's hot in here. What's, 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 up, with that? what's up with that hard cookie? Let's yeah, try. yeah, let's try the hard cookie. Ooh, good. <laughs> Ooh, this shit fire. Okay, yeah. This I'm going to give this trash. one. I'm going to give this one a six. Mm. Okay. Because it's good doable. It's doable. It's not grossing me out. It doesn't stink. Yeah, it's, it doesn't That's stink. That's boss, and it just looked boss. What's well, the glass? It's the glass, Uncle. This is twenty dollars <laughs> a glass at Crate and Barrel. It's I a glass, dude. Damn, eating, eating, eating the nasty ass mousse with the with the chocolate. It made it better. It made it better. What huh? is this? It, 
It made you appreciate the sweetness, huh? Because it's kind of dark. This chocolate chip cookie is crazy. I'm too. giving this a seven. I don't like white chocolate, but what? I'm giving this a ten. Ten? Appleton's. The last one was better than me. I like red wine better. That's yeah, really crazy. crazy. Okay, one last question. What is something, this is for everybody has to answer. What is one thing you guys want to do more together this year? I know. Travel. Travel. I'm like a big traveler. Mm -hmm. If it was up to me, once a month, I'd be going somewhere different. But when I say different, I mean out the country different. Mm -hmm. I know I don't want to go to Vegas, none of that. I want to go out the country. I want to go. Yeah, but yeah. it wasn't for you. I wouldn't have went to Italy and experienced shit like that. That was great. So, yeah. yeah, I appreciate that. She got a good uh, mind when it comes to travel. I'm good at planning too. trips. She's super good at planning. I'm a yeah. last minute Because I'm a look on TikTok. I'm a, I'm a look on Google. I'm a investigate, do all the stuff. And I'm going to be like, no, this is the best. We're going to do this on this day at this time. And you're going to wear this. That's me. Yeah. I, I'm going to say that? dating. Going out on dates. Mm. We are a lot of busy. We busy a lot. We got kids. You know, our kids, like everybody don't, ain't it's not like us. So they can go home and they can have a busy day and they can go out on dates. So I'll be like, damn, they going everywhere. You know, I'll be seeing a lot of YouTube couples and and those couples are, you know, are really my friends, but they don't have a lot of kids and shit. You know what I mean? Well, we we got to make time for ourselves to actually go out on dates. Enjoy each other. Yeah, yeah. All right, what did you guys, what was your favorite wine? Let's rate them. What was your guys' scores? I think this is my fave. The one before this for sure. This one. The one before this one was was my fave. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I rated that a nine. I didn't rate nothing a ten. I rated that shit a nine. It's lit. It's doable. Well, yeah. I loved wine tasting with you guys today. Thank you so much, Lexi and Terrell, for coming today. My glass with is us. still full. I know mine's <laughs> empty. <laughs> we got to refill. I know. Beep, beep. But thank you so much for watching Cocktails with Heather and Ad. We will be back with more videos next time. Kick Ad out and just have Lexi. Oh, okay, yeah. Probably. Yeah, okay. we could do that. But Lexi doesn't fucking Heather drink. And Lexi. We'll make mocktails. Yeah, but I know how to make drinks because I was a bartender. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Show, show. Oh, that's bartender the next Lexi in the game. That's the next episode. Jack Ryan. Mocktails with Lexi and okay, Heather. That's oh, yeah, fine. for sure. Yeah. All right, bye, y'all. Like this video, comment, subscribe, do all the shit. Bye.